So you basically just keep every second one. There's one. So then the second one goes over there. So this is the second one. And that goes there. And then there. And those are too small. Secret spices. Yeah, I'd never tell anybody that it's maple barbecue rub that you get at the bulk barn. <clears throat> Garlic salt. Yeah, to let them know what you're using. This is Traeger Prime Rib Rub. <laughs> I like how you had to relook. Is that good, sir? Just, just about as sexy as the last picture in the other video. Yeah, well, you'll be zoomed in so close they wouldn't see me anyway. I can see you on the screen. We'll see. It's just going to be a big close-up of that sexy mug of yours. And nobody's looking. Hot sauce. Do they have to use that stuff, or can no, they use anything? No, you can use anything you want. Now I just gotta add salt and pepper. You can just use salt and pepper if you want. Even that's a barbecue. <laughs> Mrs. Dash. Now all we need is Nanny to mix. Just keep wrapping around. Pull it tight so it holds it all together. There's a lot faster way to do this, but I'm not going to show it to you unless you send check or money order. Hey, hey, hey. shut oh. up and wrap. Okay, wrap. Do yeah, a wrap. <laughs> Can you see what I'm making? I wrap it in bacon. Nothing <laughs> <Not> mine. <laughs> We're on a roll. Yeah. On to the Traeger. A recap. It is your hamburger mix. In between two pieces of onion. Wrapped in bacon. Bacon cheeseburger onion rings. Cheese and the meat mixture. About an hour and 15 minutes. Then we glaze with garage burner barbecue sauce, of course. Absolutely. That's wicked. Proud. <laughs> 